Welcome back, everybody. My name is All Fun and Games. I stream every day on Twitch TV, and I also make fun videos here on YouTube. Recently, we talked about stone fruit bushes and why they're so amazing. Let's continue down that road, shall we? So stone fruits are found on none other than the lunar biome. You can find a bunch of them, but when they're gone, they're not necessarily entirely gone, but you can dig them up and relocate them accordingly. All you need to do is when you dig them up, you need to refertilize them just like you would actually getting a ton of berry bushes. When you decide to fertilize them very soon after, within a few days, maybe less, you're going to actually have a few stone fruits that are going to give you the actual stone fruit. So just imagine this, this is now fully filled with these little tiny little shrubs uh, filled with stone fruits. But the thing is, is what happens over time is eventually if you don't actually go up to it and pick them off, they'll turn to stone and rinse and repeat and you'll be fine. So basically just when they're ready to pluck, just go ahead and pluck them. And before you know it, you're going to have a smashing amount of actual stone fruits. All you need to do from there is get yourself a pickaxe and then stop. Now. The reason why I'm telling you to stop is because stone fruits are actually encased in stone. So every time you decide to unlock one, it's now going to start to become uh, the process of actually starting to rot. So stone fruits basically are inside bundle wraps that are not actually spoiling whatsoever. It's kind of stoppage in time. What I would probably suggest doing is if you do decide to actually smash these things to pieces, keep half of the stack. So if you do decide to do that, take half the stack and put the other stack obviously inside of a chest until a chest in, until you have an entire bit of stone fruit where the entire chest is filled to the brim with actual stone fruits. Then throughout the year, <coughs> cough, cough, winter time, you can actually use stone fruit to then, you know, be not super... Uh, hungry the entire year. I mean, it just makes sense, doesn't it? That's why stone fruit is so good to actually get early game. I know it's tough to find the lunar biome, and if you're struggling to do so, there are little videos that I've made previously on showcasing how to do that. But nonetheless, go out there and get yourself some stone fruit bushes, get yourself some stone fruits, and keep half the stack for winter time, or maybe the entire stack for winter time. It's entirely up to you. But just remember that when they're in the rocks, they are not spoiling whatsoever. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.